Hi there guys, it's a real pleasure to test this light. It's the new flagship model from Hydrofarm. Hydrofarm is a massive US company um, going about 40 years I think um, with many 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 different brands, um, huge distribution across literally hundreds and hundreds of grow shops across the US and Canada and further beyond. And this is one of their, um, or is their flagship uh, LED lighting model. It's by, it, their brand is called Photobio and it is the Phantom MX. That's a very large grow light suited for a 5x5, draws 680 watts and uh, yeah it's, it's a very nice fixture. Comes with all the things you'd expect from a commercial fixture so it's got a big long 10 foot or three and a half uh, meter um, power cable. It's all fully rated it's got uh, LED, the protection on the LEDs, silicone over the LEDs to protect them. Um, it's got a, a controller system, the autopilot, which um, I set, literally set up in minutes, plugged it in. And uh, that's got temperature sensors as well, so that you can monitor temperature and adjust your lighting should temperature get too high. And of course, control multiple features with um, on off timing, sunset dimming, all that stuff. Um, so very accomplished controller. The spectrum, I tested it, it's full spectrum, got plenty of blue, green and red um, and totally suitable for growing all the way from seed to flower. It's a um, mixture of white LEDs and reds for enhanced efficiency and in terms of efficiency it performed very well. I hung it in a 5 foot by 5 foot or 1.5 by 1.5 meter grow area. Adjust the height then just to get the maximum um, power intensity in the dead center where it's highest to 1000 micromoles. And as you can see, it um, delivered a really even uh, power distribution over the um, target area, the test area. The average power intensity across the test area, so 684 watts drawn, average power of 704 um, micromoles per meter square per second, and a system efficiency, that's the total power delivered to the grow area, divided by the wattage consumed, is 2.32 micromoles per watt, which is really good. They are obviously very confident in this light, they've got um, some interesting material on the product pages, um, including comparisons where they've uh, tested their light in an integrated sphere. It's on these big um, dome shapes where they have um, sensors inside, put the light fixture into it, switch it on, and they're able to sense or detect all of the light emitted from that fixture. And they've put in, I think it's five or six other main manufacturer brands um, into uh, the test, and they have a full comparison list view have it in the link in the description below if you want to check it out. But it's a nice comparison list of um, brands uh, retailed in the US at the moment. So yeah, really nice light. Um, enjoy testing it. Thanks a million to Hydrofarm for sending it through. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Take care.